Hey guys, so I am so excited to share this with you. Just came back from Pat McGrath's brunch. It was so beautiful. She launched her new lipstick lip kit line, Lust004. And I, uh, like literally we were all there just stunned. There's gold, there's a blood, there's uh, a bright red, there's a nude shade, and then there was one more. Um, I'm gonna insert a snap so you can see the shades. But I have the package here with me right now. I haven't opened it yet. This is the version Blood Wine, and this is the first edition limited release. So I can't wait to open it with you guys. Uh, I have it on now. So yeah, let's 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 dig into it. So I'm gonna open it with you. Let's see. Do I need scissors? Wait, wait, does it open this way? All right, so I have a knife. <laughs> and um, we're just gonna rip this open as gently as possible because I don't wanna ruin it. I'm just really excited to even have this in the first place, so boom. Here's your knife cameraman, thank you. There's tons of sequins in there. <laughs> okay, so the package comes with two different lipsticks. We'll open these in a bit. Comes with a clear gloss. There is this little insert that talks about the contents. There is a gold pigment, a metallic gold pigment. And there's one more thing. Yes. So this is the Blood Microfine Glitter. It's the glitter I have on my lips. So that's everything that comes in this little, cute little package. So I'm gonna go ahead and swatch the lipsticks for you. So the first one is Blood One Lipstick. And it just says Pat McGrath Labs, super simple packaging because the formulation, she told me it was just super expensive. So they tried to, uh, you know, simplify the packaging so that way, you know, it wasn't an arm and a leg for the consumer. So we have this shade here. This is Blood One, it's like a bright red. And I will tell you the texture of this is so thick and pigmented, but in the best way in the best way. So we have that one. This is Blood One. And then this one here is Blood Two. So you can see for comparison, this is more of a plummy shade, like such. So beautiful. I love that you get two different options also. So then we have the glitter. This is the Blood Microfine Glitter. So you can see it's this really beautiful red, but also has some flecks of purple in there as well. It's very, very, very subtle. So I'm gonna go ahead and actually press this onto the swatch so you can kind of see just immediately what that looks like. So I already have on Blood 2 with the Microfine Glitter. So I'm gonna take this off, put on Blood 1 and the glitter and the gloss. So you guys can kind of see the routine. So Pat told me that this was so hard to get off <laughs> and that it's super long wearing that the models wore it for at least eight hours with no touch-ups, okay? So we're gonna go ahead and attempt to take this off. Um, I'm just taking a standard wipe. So I'm pressing pretty hard here. I wanna make sure it comes off neatly. But it's not impossible. So if you're worried about that, it's not impossible to get off. Just get a really good makeup wipe. Okay, I think that's good. I'm just gonna take a foundation brush just to wipe off. Okay, that was easy enough. Okay, so I'm taking, this is Blood One. So that's that really vibrant wow. red. Oh my God, the pigmentation on this is crazy. I love the shape of it also because it, it makes it so much easier to kind of line and fill in so you don't really need a liner. And it's that perfect like blue red that makes your teeth look like super white. It reminds me a lot, actually, of NARS Dragon Girl, but the more vibrant, pigment, pigmented version, I would say. It 
definitely has that blue undertone to it. So I'm just gonna go ahead and push the glitter right on top of that. So I'm just dumping that right onto the lid and then just taking my finger to push this on. I think this is gonna be so beautiful for Christmas. Oh my God, can you imagine? And I like that it's not like messy. You know how glitter, like once it gets everywhere, it's just everywhere. Like this stuff is not, it's so controlled. I don't know how. Right? Yeah. It's not all over my face. It's so crazy. Yeah. Everything looks good. I'm like trying to figure out what to clean. I'm like, this is fine. So this is Blood One with the Blood Microfine Glitter. This is without the gloss. So now we're gonna add a little bit of the clear vinyl gloss to it so you can see what it looks like real nice and glossy on top. <sighs> and then I might add a little bit more glitter on top of that. So I think the gloss just really kind of makes it more of a, it's like it, it kind of unifies it all together in that way. Um, I personally, personally prefer it um, without the gloss because I like it to be kind of just loose. I think it gives it a little bit more shimmer than the glossiness. I think it's still pretty though. So I'm gonna take a little bit of the gold. So I'm taking a little bit of this onto my Cupid's bow for highlight. I saw that they did that to Sydney's mouth and it looked so good. So we're gonna go ahead and mimic that. And that's gonna go right here. So it just gives your Cupid's bow that like beautiful sort of golden highlight. Like I said, I think it's gonna be so perfect for the holidays. Like this for Christmas or New Year's is gonna be like out of control. So that is basically it guys. Um, I am gonna give this an A plus 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 based sheerly on I love the pigmentation. I think the colors are absolutely beautiful. The formula is so smooth, so creamy. The glitter somehow is magical in the sense that it doesn't go all over your face, doesn't make a mess anywhere. It's just, I don't even know how it works. Uh, the gloss is beautiful. Um, I, I just, I, ha I can't, I don't have enough words to say about it. Literally, uh, I've been complimented by people on the street when I came to the studio and everybody at the brunch was just so amazed and they are just so in love with this product. So I'm gonna leave all the information down in the description box so you guys can check it out, see some images, and I hope that you guys can give this a try. I think it is in Sephora. Um, it may not be in all Sephoras, so I'll have to check on that and put that down below for you guys so you can check it out and try for yourself. I am in love, like I keep saying. So I thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know what you think down below, what your favorite color is. Is it blood one or blood two? And I will catch you next time.